Okay, I'm back, and we're gonna talk about propagating your poinsettia. So this is by stem cutting. I don't know if you can do it by water. I've not learned about that yet. So first you're gonna need your container, any container. I'm choosing this one. My plants believe in me. My aunt gave it to me, so I wanna use it. So in here I have some rocks. So what you're going to do, this doesn't have any drainage, and I recommend this for any plant you're potting. Line your bottom of your um, container with rocks. I feel like it helps uh, drain. Help with the drainage. So here, take a look. So what I've done is I've just seriously just lined the bottom with pebbles. All right, even them out. All right, and now let's take our cutting. So, so I recommend maybe getting a couple nodes. So let's go one, two, three nodes down. So what I mean by node is, I forgot to show you here on camera. Ooh, that splattered. Wipe it off. All right. So this is a node. This is a node. Then this is a node. So it's basically where the leaf was. So now what you're gonna do, so let's remove this poinsettia so that you can see what I'm doing here. All right. So what you're gonna do is run the bottom of the rock. And you're just gonna put a nice layer of soil. Just a nice layer. Okay, and then now what you're gonna do, so you've created a nice layer of soil. All right, so now I'll just shove it in there, really nice, nice and firm, and fill it in. Fill in around the plant. All right, and that's it for propagation. Uh, so now what you're gonna do for propagation is you're gonna put this in a sunny windowsill or somewhere um, that gets a lot of light. This is poisonous to pets, but the pets have to eat a lot of it, like a lot of poinsettia leaves to even get poisoned. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna water this in and that's pretty much the end of the video. So um, thank you for joining me today. Oh wait, hang on. Let's talk about poinsettia care though. So once you've cut off all the flowers, Actually, okay, so you know those red parts? Those red parts on the poinsettia? Those are not flowers, those are leaves. Those are leaves that are surrounding the flower. Here, let me show you. Let me show you. Now we get a flower out. Okay. Yeah, here. Find a flower. Let's see. Okay, wait, 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 wait. All right. So these are just leaves. The red part is leaves, and then you should see a little yellow in the center where the leaves are all conjoining. You should see some yellow. The yellow is the flower. The red is not the flower. The yellow inside of the red, like the inside of like the, the center of like the rosette, that is the flower. The red is just supposed to help track bees. So yeah. So poinsettias want a really nice sunny spot in your house. So um, maybe like a south facing window. So I, I would put my poinsettia in like a south facing window. 
Um, it depends on how big it is. If your poinsettia is that size, that like I just have, that we just cut up. If your poinsettia is that the size that we just cut up, I'd put it on a, on the floor in the same room as the south facing window. Um, do not give them direct light. They don't want direct light, and they want to dry out between waterings. I think I I would put this plant on moderately simple on the scale, like, so there's, so I'm, I'm picturing a scale, okay? There's a scale, there's super easy, moderately easy, um, and then difficult, and then like expert level. So I would put this on moderately easy. It's not difficult, but it's not easy. So I would just let it dry out between waterings, fertilize once a month from February until the autumn, and then when you're wanting your plant to flower again, um, um, when you want your plant to flower again, start putting it in darkness, put it in darkness, like just put it somewhere where there's no sunlight and then bring it out for two hours and then put it back in. So every day it just needs two hours of sunlight when you want it to flower again. Um, so yeah, darkness. Then bring it out for two hours and the next day put it back in the closet and then bring it out for two hours. And that's pretty much all it is to poinsettias. I hope you have a nice day. Bye!